Dime Dropper fam. I know what you're thinking. A vlog in the middle of August? What is going on here? Well, besides the Locked On news, and by the way, shout out to everybody who congratulated me for that. Yes, I'm the new host of Locked On Clippers. That does not mean anything, though, for the Clippers content on Dime Dropper. I'm still going to be going live after games and doing all that. It just may be a little tougher. I may have to do a little bit less, and Laker lives may take a hit. I'm going to try my best, though, guys. But another job I got was an ambassador for, yes, my favorite team, my football team that I waited my whole life for, the Super Bowl champions, LA Rams. I'm working for the champions this year as an ambassador, which just means I help with game day operations. I don't know how much that means and what that entails for the games, but that's why we're filming this vlog. It's my first day on the job today. I'm playing the Texans preseason. Let's see how it goes. Let's see what my job entails. You'll be here all for the ride. And hopefully if the job entails me being in good positions to watch the, a little bit of the games, we can get some vlogs for the Rams this season on Dime Dropper in addition to our other vlogs, which could be in jeopardy depending on another job offer I have or opportunity that I'm going for. But let's see how this goes. Cue the music. We're heading to the bus down, baby. Let's go to Inglewood. Go to Alexander. Chapman for three. Bang! The win. Got it. Got it. He is hard to believe. Here's Jordan. Yes. The magic of 360 turn with the dribble. Magic down the middle. Gets underneath the worthy. Slam dunk. We have arrived at Bust Down headquarters, ladies and gentlemen. Here we are, here I am. I'll take that fucking drink and that hot dog now because are you kidding me? I'm working for the champions. This is surreal. Oh, let's get ready to see what they got for me. Come on, son, it doesn't get better than this. I'm already in my championship shirt. One of the two that I have, one has everybody's name on the back. This one, not so much, but by the way, let me know if the camera's too shaky, if, you know, it's bad quality. Like, let me know all that stuff. You know what I'm saying? So I know I'm walking right now and it's a little shaky, but. Can't wait. Absolute scenes, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> they built a lake. I still can never get over that. Oh my God. Best stadium in the world. World Cup 2026, you already know how it goes. All right, we are here in our VIP lounge, the YouTube theater, not VIP lounge, YouTube theater. And a little break. All we're getting is chips though. Motherfuckers eating fajitas over here. We may be peasants right now. But look, we out here credential, logo, baby, yes, sir. So we're on our way to the VIP lobby. Just got to take some more videos of this bust down stadium that belongs to the champions. But take a look at this bust down stadium in the works right now. That's the Intuit Dome Clipper Nation. I cannot wait. We still got some business to take care of at the Staples Center this year. Oh, man. Cannot wait. Better sound and less Laker infiltration. 2025, you already know, 2024-25. Let's get it. I don't know what this is, but this is some kind of luxury section because, wow, you got like nice couches over here. Damn. This is where we're supposed to be, I guess. So obviously, as you can see, I'm in a suite level. That's where they stationed me today. This is the lobby. It's known as VIP Lobby 12 on level five. So I got all these sweet numbers on me. It's to direct people. And here's where I'm at. Perch Suites 5NE. There's the door. There's the hall. And here is the field. So right now is the calm before the storm. People are starting to file in and I'm not gonna lie, I think customer service is for me because I love talking to people. I just love having a smile on my face and it's impossible not to have a smile on your face when you're in this bust down stadium that I've waited for my whole life. Home of the champions, of course. I'm gonna remind you guys every single week this season. But yeah, it's awesome. I don't know, just, hey, here are your tickets, man. Uh, here's where you gotta go. I don't know, I enjoy it. Hopefully I get to watch some of the game though and get some good videos for you guys. 
Team's out here warming up. There's the great Matt Gay. Getting ready for his field goals, baby. Just like he beat Tampa Bay last year. Here are the Texans. Oh, Rams Nation already getting going. Let's see how much we've built fans this year after we won the Super Bowl. It's, it's been going up each year. But now, I mean, winning a Super Bowl is nothing better to get fans than that. So let's see if we get even more commotion. There's a legend, Matt Gay, Super Bowl champ. People already fucking up so bad on the first day. Sending people to the wrong sections. Sending people that aren't supposed to be in suites into suites. I gotta redirect, it's a whole mess. But we'll keep you posted. It's fun though, I'm having fun. I was too busy helping a customer, or a fan, but Trevor Ariza just walked through. Ah, that was an opportunity right there. <laughs> we live though, about to be kickoff time. Seven minutes to go in the first quarter. Got Wolford out there. Okay. Oh, he got the first. Oh, bullshit. Oh, oh my God. Not a sellout tonight in preseason, but man, still pretty solid attendance. I've never been this high in this stadium. It's actually not too high. I wonder what it's like on the top row. The fabulous forum. It just breathes greatness, doesn't it? It has a new sign now, the Kia Forum. Originally the Great Western Forum for a little bit. But wow, it's so beautiful. Right here by the by stadium sign and the north end zone area. So right now, I just finished my break. I don't feel like I'm missing anything really. I know there's a lot of noise right now in the background, but I don't feel like I'm missing anything. Cause it's preseason. I hate preseason sports, any sport. So I'm not really tripping. We don't even have Stafford out there and like all our starters. So like, don't really care, but we'll see how I feel when it's the season, so not being able to like watch watch the games got to cherish the road games oh aaron donald on the jumbotron oh the roar from the crowd you gotta love it well done Damn. 
No, that wasn't complete. Oh, this so we lost, but take a look how interesting this is. This is how they get the logo off the middle of the field. That guy's doing it right now. It's fading already. So interesting. 24 to 23, 24 to 20 we lost, but it's obviously preseason, doesn't matter, but I'll let you guys know how I felt about the day in a sec. So night one in the books. Uh, I have to say it was pretty fun. I just love interacting with people. So many beautiful women out here, man. Fuck, <laughs> makes me wish I had a girl, but nah, you know, you gotta focus on the grind. And the grind right now was, it was preseason, so I wasn't really like fear of missing out on anything of the game. We'll see how I feel though during the season, especially banner night. That's gonna be an emotional night. I've waited for that my whole life. So if I don't get to really watch the game and that'll be tough, but I had a great time. It's just amazing to be here. I, I mean, this stadium is, I mean, you guys have watched my videos. It's everything I've wished for and dreamed of as I was a kid. And now I get to know it inside and out. I get to know where the south end zone is, the north end zone is, which signs are where. It's awesome and I'm having a good time, but on to the next one. We're gonna keep doing these vlogs, so we'll see how it goes.